welcome to another episode of the Pierce Brothers. Today we're doing a mini 14 shoot. Uh, anyways, just all mini 14s, no pistols. Uh, so the course is, is that we got uh, the tree, got zombies, uh, round steel targets, a um, few soda cans in the mix, and then we got a 300 yard target, silhouette target up there. Uh, it'll be kind of a challenge for the minis, you know, firing fast and through a course like that and being warm on that 300 yard target, but we'll see how they do. Uh, everyone has to shoot five rounds on the silhouette target down there. So, anyways. Each hit on the silhouette. Yeah, each hit on the silhouette is uh, minus is five yeah. seconds from your time. Every miss adds five seconds. So, if you shoot one and hit it and shoot one and miss, they cancel each other out. And after five shots, we'll see what the average is. So, all right, well, let's get started. You ready? Yep, I'm ready. One more soda can. Which one is it? Right in the middle. No, right over here. No, right here, oh. straight ahead. <laughs> you fools, I should have counted. Low. Time? Five misses. Minute 50. So. 215. 215. That's not bad. That's pretty good, yeah. Especially where you missed the soda can and like. <laughs> I didn't well, even see it either. Shooting the spent soda cans. Mm -hmm. The what? Oh, yeah, the already one. <laughs> I should have counted. Nope. <laughs> I told you guys, hey, we placed them different. different. Look where they are. Okay, well, let's I was hide looking, them but Joe. they're all camouflage. Let's, let's, we need to hide them like Joe. Yeah. <laughs> I'll camouflage it in the mix of all the shot up ones. It's like that. But, but we... There you go. Okay, you ready? I think so. Okay, you ready? Three, two, one, go. That's six. Good, good, yep. good. There we go. A better process of reloading here. <laughs> okay, on to the end.
Hit. So I had 15 seconds. Well, one hit, he missed four. So, uh, yeah, yeah. 15, so two, 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 oh, two. So two, two, 17. 17. What was Jake's time? I don't remember. Two, uh, two, uh, two, 15. Cause he missed all five. Yeah. Huh. Huh. Okay. Not too bad, Will. <laughs> That's why I've never shot this before. I'd say that's not bad. <laughs> yeah. All right. Okay. Yeah. Three, two, one, go. How many is that? Five. One more. No hits. 148 plus 25. Yeah, not very good for me. So but that'd be 208. 213. 213. So we beat you by, what was your time? 217. No, 215 and then 217. So we're all two seconds apart so far. 213, 215, 217. That tree threw me off. Yeah. Anyways. This is the closest shoot we've had so far, as far yeah. as times. <laughs> Most competitive. I guess we'll see how uh, Big Fella does. And Dad, yep. Yeah, and Dad. <laughs> All right, on to Dad. Okay. Brian Pierce with the Pierce Brothers using a Mini 14 Shorty today. Uh, I think they call it the Tactical, and uh, I chose to go without uh, optics today. So we'll see how it goes. Well, fun. Okay, ready? Yep. Three. One, go.
Definitely hitting low. <laughs> no hit, so minute 55 plus 25. So two, two, 220. 20. Yeah, 220. We're all still within a, <laughs> a couple. We're all what, Joe? We're all within a few seconds of each other still. <laughs> that was pretty cool with Dad's dude. Yeah. Hey guys, Joe here. Um, I'm shooting my wife's mini. I've only shot this one time. I put one mag through it here a bit ago. So uh, <laughs> we'll see how this goes. I turned my hat backwards when I'm using the scope or magnifier because my brim gets in the way. So I prefer to, so that's why I flip my hat backwards. I don't usually do that. We'll see where she's hitting, eh? All right, ready? Yeah. Three hits out of five. All right. Woo! It was definitely the supreme leader on this. Yeah. So what I get? Minute thirty-four. Minus five. Uh, no, at five. I mean, yeah, minus five. Sorry. Yeah. yeah. So I got one twenty-nine. One twenty-nine. Yeah. Wow! I schooled you guys. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Did a good job there, Joe. Yeah, that's actually sighted right in. I'm surprised. My wife's gun and all. <laughs> um, she's only shot it once. We need to get a better scope on there, but it's got this uh the side folding stock that's uh AR-15 style collapsible. So comes from the factory that way. All right, so that's wrap on that uh mini 14 zombie shoe. Uh Takeaway is, is, you know, a uh, very simplisticated uh, machine here. Uh, <laughs> uh, very similar on times, except for Joe. He hit, a, he hit the longer range steel a few different, a few times there, so it really whittled his time way down. Uh, anyways, yeah. Uh, I guess lesson learned with me is <clears throat> I don't have much of time behind the May 14. I know Porter got quite a few thousand around behind it. Uh, yeah. I don't own one, actually. I borrowed one this one from my dad. And uh, just using iron sights, they weren't quite sighted in, so it definitely tell uh, you could tell at the uh, long-range um, target uh, hitting pretty low. But uh, at the closer range, I was able to overcome that pretty easy, you know, once I figured out kind of where to hold. Yeah. Um, I did have a couple malfunctions. Uh, one was... Couldn't find the uh, the the can to shoot, so I ended up shooting two already shot cans, and then one of Porter's magazines didn't lock open, so I had to. That cost me a little time. Um, Porter's magazines are well used. Let's just put it yeah. that way. <laughs> yeah, well used. So, <laughs> or not. Um, but yeah, Mini Fourteen in in particular is a pretty nice rifle, especially the newer ones when Ruger did the the upgrades to them. So. Yeah, they shoot a little better than the older ones. Yeah, reliability's always been there. They're a good, solid rifle. So, not for everybody. You know, some people don't like them, but yeah, it's certainly a, a good each, rifle. Each their own. Yeah, but every every gun has its good and bad points. So, anyway, you want any thoughts, Dan? Well, you kind of re hit on it. We we hustle all, all five of us to get up here, 
and you know meet at a at a neutral location and do these videos and and uh, I was grabbing minis and different ammo. I didn't want to use my good hand loads up because that's what some of these are sighted for. And we're trying to side off hand with fifty five and sixty two grain and this and that bulk ammo, and that's what really cost us on the long range targets because they weren't really zeroed with that stuff. And uh, so it you know in the real world to take a given rifle with a given ammo and it'd be zeroed and dead on. And, these guns all would have done better if we'd have put a little more effort in up front to get them ready to, for this type of a competition. But uh, but it does show one thing that's really interesting is that um, uh, how close everybody's time were with, mm -hmm. with yeah. all these in the similar rifles. And uh, so you can take somebody that's just an average shot or average skill level, and they should be able to do pretty darn good with a mini in a, in a close quarters type of a situation. So... Um, Anyway, just food for thought. Yep. I think that's everything that's good, you know? Well, thanks for watching. Uh, we'll